Hey guys, welcome to Listen to Your Inner You. I am Babs and I welcome you on this beautiful day. I'm in my backyard. It is 60 degrees Fahrenheit, about 15 Celsius. And it's winter time. <laughs> it's gorgeous out. Welcome and thank you for watching. I really appreciate it. I wanted to just give a little tip on what happens, what, what you should try to make it happen when you go through a breakup, right? We've all been through them and they're the worst when it's your um, special person that you're manifesting back, you're the one or twin flame soulmate, whatever it is, right? And it sucks so bad and it hurts so bad and it's normal. So I would say if you're going through a breakup right now, if it just recently happened or if it's been going on for a while and you're having a hard time, I would like you to accept that it happened. Don't deny it. Don't lie to people around you that you're still together or, or avoid questions. Just straight up accept that it happened. I accept that we're broken up. I accept that we broke up. I accept whatever you need to accept, right? You always want to accept the current circumstances. I'm telling you acceptance is one of the miracle things to do. So accept that it happened. And then just grieve instead of going right to manifesting. Go grieve. Go be upset. Breaking up. One time I had a therapist tell me that a severe breakup is just like someone dying. It's to your brain and your heart. It's the same kind of impact. I don't know if that's true. I've never lost anyone close to me other than a friend who we weren't as close as we used to be. And that was hard. Um, but I don't know. You know, I haven't gone through that. But it was... I've had some terrible breakups and they were awful and I've made all the mistakes and I you know I'm just here to maybe help you so accept that it happened and then grieve just let it all out it's not being hung up on it you gotta let it out grief is an actual thing that you have to go through and then start doing you start doing you if, if you need help with start doing you go watch Veronica's 25 day challenge to get your ex back right she gets you back in shape and, and it'll help you to concentrate on your life again and to get back on track. Do your hair, do your nails, buy clothes, go hiking, read a book, do whatever, you know. So I want you to just go through all the stages that are a part of it because a breakup is an actual circumstance that affects you. You can't just sit there and ignore that it happened. Like ignoring your circumstances is the worst idea. I, first of all, I never promote that anyways. Although circumstances for manifesting do not matter, doesn't mean that you want to ignore them. You still are allowed to react to them. As a matter of fact, please do react to them. React to all of your circumstances, especially during a breakup. You want to react to it. You want to grieve. You want to let it out. You don't want to get attached or hung up on it. Obviously, for manifesting, attachment is the worst um, and the least conducive to it. But work on it and just let it out and then don't deny that it happened just go through all the stages that it takes do what makes you feel better if, if grieving makes you feel better go grieve you should grieve it's an awful event it hurts your heart is broken of course your heart is broken doesn't mean that the other person isn't suffering you don't know what's going on in their life sometimes a breakup is the better option right you just don't know just just accept that it's going on Accept it. Grieve it. Acceptance in this case is so important. I've gone through a breakup where I didn't accept it for three months and kept lying to everyone and didn't get me anywhere. Because then you're just prolonging it. And it didn't feel good. As soon as I accepted it, within a day I felt better. You know, and it's not the end all. You don't have to need, you, have, you don't have to have that person in your life. You want them. You don't need them. So do you. Start learning how to do you, mentally, physically, on the outside, on the inside, all of you. So accept it, grieve it, live you, do you. And that's so important. And it's it's easier said than done, I know that. I've been through all of them too, just like you have. But I made it through, I'm still alive, I'm here. I made it, and so will you. You can do this as well. So that's just my little tip for breakups. Don't 
get into denial, just accept it, accept everything that's going on, accept things that have been said. If you're ready to start working on the manifesting part after you're done grieving, or while you want to grieve and do the, at the same time, do that, but only if you can handle it emotionally, right? Because you have to process all of these emotions. And when you start manifesting, there's more emotions to process, obviously. But turn the stories around that were said during the breakup. So for a breakup, remember what was said and done because that person will most likely push out why they broke up, what is going on inside of you and why the breakup happened. So you wanna start turning those stories around at some point. And if you keep losing a person, that is an indication that you have core belief issues, but it could be something else too, attachment, you know, name it, there's a million things. I can't, you can leave comments in this video and I can't help you unless we go into a session and we tap into all of that, right? There's a lot that goes into this. It's sometimes it's a really simple fix and sometimes it's not. And sometimes it takes a whole session to actually figure out that it was a simple fix or more complicated. I don't know. My clients can tell you that is true. But yeah, accept it. Don't deny it. Grieve. Feel it. And do you. Learn how to do you. Veronica back in the day helped me a lot with her 25 day ex back because it wasn't about getting my ex back at that point. It was just about feeling better. And that's really what you want to do. You want to feel better again, right? You want to get over the breakup. You want to get over the heartache. And eventually, if that's the right person, you want to manifest them back. But it takes a lot to get there. So give yourself a break and enjoy you once you are done grieving. Just, just be you again and enjoy it. Learn how to enjoy it. Learn, learn how to love yourself. All of that, right? Whatever needs to be changed, change it. That's why it happens. These breakups ha happen so we can change something about us there's always a message behind it so find out what the message is that is just my little advice for today i hope that helped don't get into denial like accept things grieve feel it all let it out and then be you have a wonderful day enjoy whatever weather is going on on your end bye